All right, y'all. Peace and blessings. God bless you all. I'm Jarvis Kingston, and I hope that y'all doing all right and staying strong and solid in these times that we're in. I pray that you have repented and that you were baptized. I pray that you are safe, protected, and prayed up. And I just pray that whatever situation that you're going through, that the Lord is with you, that he guides you, protects you, he looks out for you, he comforts you. I pray that your mental health gets better and that you become more strong and wise in the Lord. I pray that you keep fighting the good fight of faith. You keep running your race. You keep your eyes fixed on the Messiah. You keep your eyes fixed on the prize. You stay on that narrow straight gate path and you help out plenty of people along your journey forevermore. Amen. Always remember that the Lord will never leave you nor forsake you and that the Messiah intercedes for you. The spirit intercedes for you as well. So always stay thankful, grateful, appreciative and take it one day at a time. Most definitely, let us thank the Lord for another day. Let us thank the Lord for waking us up and giving us another day to seek his face. Let us thank the Lord for food in our belly, clothes in our back and a roof over our head. Let us thank the Lord for protecting us coming in and going out, guiding us through the morning, getting us through the afternoon, getting us through the evenings, getting us through the nights, the week. He is constantly looking out for us with his grace, mercy, favor, love, the outstretched arm of God, the mighty hand of God, the finger of God, his word, his only begotten son who died for our sins. There's plenty of things the most high has done for us through our lifetime and continues to keep doing for us because his mercy is everlasting and his truth endures forever. Amen. So always keep him first. Always worship him. Thank him. Praise him. Call on him. Sing a song to him. Hearken to his word. Hearken to his voice. Obey that still voice and trust him in everything you got going on in your life. Most definitely. Welcome everyone. I appreciate all of you for listening and supporting. It means a lot to me. I love you all. Praying for you all. Let us always uplift each other in Christ and encourage each other in the Lord. Let us always pray for each other, intercede for one another, comfort each other, support each other, lift each other up. All those great, awesome, amazing things, people. Brothers and sisters of the faith all over the world, let us be together on one accord for the Lord. Amen. Much love to the 12 tribes of Israel scattered all four corners of the earth, all the scattered Israelites among the nations, all ends of the earth. Much love to the churches and ministries out there with the sound doctrine, the peace, the love, the harmony, the fellowship, and the services. Much love to all the previous martyrs, the current martyrs, and the future martyrs. The brave, bold, isolated, courageous believers who are going through it for the gospel, who are being persecuted for the faith, who are going through many tribulations and hardships for his name's sake. Stay strong, steadfast, firm, and encouraged. We are always by your side. The Messiah is with us always forever to the end of age. Hallelujah. Amen. So stay strong and encouraged. Always upright people. Most definitely. Much love to the great tribulation saints down the road. Much love to all the grafted and Gentiles of all nations, tribes, languages, tongues, races, faces, kinships all over the world. Much love to all the brand new creatures of Christ out there, all the born again people, the Holy Spirit filled people. Most definitely all believers, all walks of life. God bless all of you. Anyone who just repented, God bless you. Anyone who just got baptized, God bless you as well. Anybody who's having dreams, encounters, visions, testimonies, God bless you also. If you did not repent and get baptized, go repent, get baptized ASAP immediately. Shalom, family, greetings to all of you. Welcome everyone, all peoples, all nations, all tribes, all languages, all tongues, all races, all faces, all kindreds, everybody. Let everything that has breath Praise the Lord, all the animals, all the creatures, all the beasts, all the fishes in the sea, the birds in the air, the trees, the plants, the mountains, the insects. Let all of God's creation praise him. Amen. Whether you are an Israelite or a Gentile, it is all right. Whether you are chosen or adopted, grafted in, it is all right. Let us gather together and praise the Most High. Sing a new song, clap our hands, stomp our feet, praise him. Rejoice, always rejoice. Make a joyful noise, make a joyful sound, crowd to him, dance, express yourself, play an instrument, do what you have to do for the Most High God. He is always watching us, so always serve him with gladness and joy. And always worship in spirit and truth. Amen. Hear, O Israel, the Lord our God is one Lord. Love the Lord your God with all your mind, heart, soul, strength, and might. Love your neighbor as you love yourself. Let us keep doing Father's business and Father's will for the rest of our lives till the sun comes back. Amen. He has come back like a thief in the night in a twinkling of an eye. He has come back at an hour nobody knows but the Father. Let us be alert, sober, vigilant, watchful, prayed up, washed by the water, by the word, the washing of the water through the word. Let us keep our lamp and oil. Let us stay on our purpose and call for the most high God. Let us know the Lord better. Let's get more close to him. Let's seek his face. Draw near to God. He'll draw near to you. Let us obey the gospel. Let us obey the law, statutes, and commandments. Let us obey all of God's word. Anything the Most High has told us, person, according to our life, our calling, our purpose, our situation, our gifts, our talents, our circumstances, handle it, people. Keep it all together for the Most High God. Keep the faith. Keep the word of God. Keep a testimony of the Messiah. Keep the law, statutes, commandments, decrees, precepts, ordinances, covenants, judgments, charges, observances, all of it. Get a five-subject notebook. Get a pack of 24 pens, get a Bible, write a whole copy of the Torah from Genesis all the way to Deuteronomy, by the jot, by the tittle, by the line, by the precept, keep all the commandments, people, and let us embrace that new covenant heavy, most definitely. Stay strong and encouraged. You are redeemed, restored, forgiven, embraced. You are cherished in the kingdom, amen. You got worth and value in the kingdom. Don't let nobody tell you otherwise, amen. The most high, the Bible already validates us, so let's now seek the world's validation, amen. 
All right, y'all. So today's message, what I love to do is go through today's daily devotional in the email, and then I will close out with the prayer. I will close out with the priestly blessing, and I will close out giving all the praise, honor, and glory to the Most High God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob, and praise His only begotten Son who died for our sins. Amen. Hallelujah. So here we go. All right, y'all. So let's go through with the prayer. The daily one is based in Psalm 8, verse 3 through 4. It starts off with a verse of good and upright is the Lord. Therefore, will he teach sinners in the way? Psalm 25, verse 8. Amen. Devotion based on Psalm 25. And tonight's Psalm, David comes before God in complete honesty, saying he is lonely and afflicted. Those are feelings to which we can all relate. But in reality, we are never alone. The Lord's compassion and faithful love are with us every moment, every day and night. Because of this, we can find the rest we need as we dwell in his presence. As you close your eyes and turn from the events of the day, breathe in his breath of life and breathe out the stress you carry. Turn your heart and mind towards Jesus and rest in his arms. Relinquish your burdens to him. Listen for his voice of love toward you. In him, you can put your trust and you and know you are safe in his care. Amen. Acts reflection, adoration, allow God's goodness to seep into your soul. Feel his love come over you. Worship him for his faithful love. Bask in his presence and peace. Rest in knowing that he is God and he is watching over you. Confession. Think through your day and acknowledge any sins that come to mind, asking God to forgive you. Pray for him to take away your guilt and shame. Thanksgiving. Thank God for being trustworthy and for bringing you hope. Thank him for being your redeemer and giving you good gifts. Thank him for the times he has protected you and delivered you. Supplication. Heavenly Father, teach me your ways and guide me on a secure path where I will be safe. I want to hear your voice and be in the center of your will for my life. Be my refuge and strength and ever-present help in my times of need. Help me to remember the unending love you have for me and that I can rest in it with my whole heart. I praise you and give you glory. Amen. Most definitely, we must depend on prayer because our mission depends on miracles. Prayer is not for preparation for the battle. It is the battle. Amen. Scripture. When I consider your heavens, the work of your fingers, the moon and the stars, which you have ordained, what is man that you think of him? What is the son of man that you care for him? Psalm 8, verses 3 through 4. The prayer. O Lord, my God, how majestic is your name. Your glory is clearly shown in the heavens, expanse, and the earth's beauty. Who am I, Lord, that you even listen to my prayers? Who I am that you would bend down to bless, teach, and love me. You hold the universe in the span of your hand. You command seas to rise with the tide and mountains to crumble under their own weight. You are truly majestic. I am grateful for your powerful presence and steadfast love in my life. I pray that you would give me childlike wonder when considering your creation and character. As I rest, give me a sense of awe at just how magnificent you are. In Jesus' mighty name I pray. Amen. Hallelujah. Praise the most high God of heaven and earth. Yes, he's the God of Shem. Praise the most high God. He's the God of Abraham, the God of Isaac, the God of Jacob. He is the God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob forever. He is the God of Israel. He is the God of the Hebrews. He is the God of Jeshurun. He is the Lord of the armies. He is the God of Noah, Job, and Daniel. Hallelujah. Praise the most high God. He's the God of David. Praise the most high God. His only begotten son died for our sins, rose up three days later. Much love to the Messiah for shuns blood for all of us. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. He is the last Adam, the second Adam. Praise the Lord. Yes, the Messiah. He is the advocate. Hallelujah. Praise him. The Almighty, true and living God. Praise the Lord. The Alpha and Omega. Amen. The apostle of our profession, the arm of the Lord, the atonement sacrifice for our sins, the author and finisher of our faith, the author and perfecter of our faith, the author of life, the author of salvation, the beginning and the end, the beginning of creation of God, the beloved son, the blessed and only potent, the blessed and only ruler. The blessed and only sovereign, the branch, the bread of God, the bread of life, the bridegroom, the capstone, the captain of salvation, the chief cornerstone, the chief shepherd, Christ, the Christ of God, the constellation of Israel, the cornerstone, the counselor, wonderful counselor, the creator, the day spring, the deliverer, the desire of the nations, the door, the elect of God, Emmanuel, Emmanuel, God is with us, eternal life, everlasting father, faith and true witness, faithful and true, the faithful witness, the first and last, the first begotten, the first born from the dead, first born over all creation. The forerunner, the gate, the glory of the Lord, God, the good shepherd, the great high priest, the great shepherd, the head of the church, the heir of all things, the heir of all things, the high priest, holy and true, the holy one, the hope, the hope of glory, the horn of salvation, the I am, the I am that I am, the I am who I am, the great I am, the image of God, Yehovah. Yahushua, most definitely, Jesus of Nazareth, Jesus, the judge of Israel, the judge, king eternal. Yes, Jehovah Jireh, Jehovah Shalom, Jehovah Nassai. Yes, he's the king of Israel, the king of kings, the king of kings, the Lord of lords. Hosanna, Hosanna in the highest praise. Hosanna, the son of David. Blessed be he that comes in the name of the Lord. We have blessed you out of the house of the Lord. 
king of saints, king of the ages, king of the Jews, the king, the lamb, the lamb of God, the lamb without blemish, the last Adam, the lawgiver, the leader, commander, the life, the lie of the world, the lion of the tribe of Judah, the living one, the living stone, the Lord, the Lord, our righteousness, the Lord is holiness, the Lord is my banner, the Lord is my portion, the Lord is my strength, my rock, my refuge, my good fortress, my high tower, my shield, my buckler, my safety, my defense, my redeemer, my salvation, my healer, my helper, my protector, our provider, our safety, our defense, always forever, praise him. Our provider always, Yah, Yahweh, Yahuwah, Yahweh, Shai, Yahweh, Be Yahweh, Ahai, Yeshai, Yeshua, Hamashiach, Barakatha, Shalom, Shalom, Yeshua, Elohim, Yehosha, Yehusha, Yehosha, Ahai, Yeshaya, Adonai, Abba. He is the consuming fire. He is the father of heavenly lights. He is the father of the fatherless, the father of widows, the father of mercies. He is the God of heaven and earth. His son sits at the right hand of him. The government rests on his shoulders. He is the great physician, could cure all things, heal all things. He is the carpenter, could fix all things. With God, all things are possible. Nothing is too hard for the Lord. God made everything in six days and rested on the seventh day. He could fix the situation right now. They would just, we touch and agree, y'all. Call on him, he'll show you great, mighty things. Search and seek him with all your heart and you will find him. He is a reward to those who seek him diligently. Know that he exists. Believe in him. Trust him. They could do for you. Abide in him. Abide in his word. As the Father, you need in his son's name, it shall be given to you. Healing, restoration, deliverance, miracle signs, wonders, help, things going in your favor, favor over your life. I speak that forever. Double portion, bless, unexpected good news, unexpected good turnarounds. We speak that in the, most, in the Messiah's name, most definitely for sure. He got us forever, y'all. Praise him. We know that for the rest of our lives, the outstretched arm of God will be in our lives forever. The mighty hand of God will be in our lives forever. The finger of God will be in our lives forever. Our faith has made us well. Our faith has saved us. Our faith has blessed. Our faith is how we overcome the world. We walk by faith and not by sight. We're justified by faith in the Messiah. The just shall live by faith. We are in agreement with the Father, Son, Holy Spirit. God is one. Yes, the Lord straightened out the crooked paths. He straightened out the crooked things. Amen. He's going to straighten all of us out. He's going to straighten out all of our problems. Amen. Praise him, y'all. He is the Lord of all, the Lord of glory, the Lord of lords, the man from heaven, the man of sorrows, the mediator of the new covenant, the mediator, the messenger of the covenant, the Messiah, the mighty God, the mighty one, the morning star, the Nazarene, the offspring of David, the only begotten son of God, our great God, our savior, our holiness, our husband, our Passover, our protection, our redemption, our righteousness, our sacrifice, the Passover lamb, the power of God, the precious cornerstone, the prince of kings, the prince of life, the prince of peace, the prophet, the redeemer, the resurrection of life, the resurrection, the resurrected of life, the life giver the abundant life the revelation the revelator the righteous branch the righteous one the radiant one the perfect example the rock the root of david the rose of sharon the ruler of god's creation the ruler of the kings of the earth the savior the seed of woman the shepherd and bishop of souls the shiloh the son of abraham the son of david the son of god the son of man son of the blessed son of the most high god the source of eternal salvation for all who obey him the son of righteousness the just one the one mediator the stone the builders rejected the true bread the true god the true light the true vine he is the truth amen he is the way hallelujah he is the way truth and life praise him the wisdom of god the witness the wonderful counselor the word the word of god the word of life the word of yahuwah the word of elohim the word made flesh the living word the word of yehovah the word of yahusha hallelujah praise him always forever we know that his word is purifying silver just as david said in the psalms we know that every word of god is true pure and flawless as the book of proverbs says and we know that his words are double as the book of hebrews says i mean we touch and agree y'all the messiah is the high priest of the order of melchizedek he is a sinless high priest he's the everlasting king he's the way everlasting most definitely y'all praise him let us repent and get baptized. Let us forgive others so that the Heavenly Father can forgive us. Let us be blameless before the Lord, our God. Let us circumcise our hearts. Let us write a whole copy of the Torah and keep it near and dear in our hearts. Amen. Prayers up for all all people, all walks of life. Prayers up for all the poor people, all the widows, all the orphans, all the fathers, the tribe of Levi. Prayers up for the sojourners, the, the refugees, the uh, all peoples, man, everybody. Prayers up for all households, all marriages, all single people, married people, divorced people, widowed people. Prayers up for the elders. Prayers up for the uh, senior citizens, the adults, the children. The babies, the boys, the young girls, the young boys, prayers are for people in prison, in the hospital, prayers are for people in trial, on court, prayers are for people in all the situations and circumstances and environments, all right? Our Father in heaven, hallowed be your name, your kingdom come, your will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our debts as we forgive our debt doors. And do not lead us into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For yours is the kingdom and the power and the honor and the glory forever. Amen. The Lord bless you and keep you. The Lord make his face shine upon you and be gracious to you. The Lord lift up his counsels upon you and give you peace. And they shall put my name on the children of Israel and I will bless them. Shalom. Amen. Selah Barakatha. I'm Jarvis Kingston. I love you all. Praying for you all. Peace.